The new Quick Path keyboard in iOS 13 lets us swipe to type. This has been available before on third-party keyboards, but it's now built directly into the standard iOS 13 keyboard. So we can still tap to type or swipe without switching to a different keyboard. The Quick Path swiping method will take some time getting used to if you haven't tried it before. But it's surprisingly accurate and pretty easy to get the hang of. Basically, you're still typing out the words, but not lifting your finger off the display. The software will automatically enter the spaces between your words and perform autocorrect. For the word then, I'll make a zigzag swipe from the T to the H to the E and N. Whether or not you'll want to use this swiping method as your primary typing style on the iPhone keyboard is going to be a personal preference. The standard iPad keyboard doesn't offer the Quick Path Swipe to Type option. I can swipe all I want here and nothing much happens. I'd assume this is because the iPad keyboard is just too large for swipe to type to make much sense. But we can now pinch the keyboard to make it smaller here on the iPad. It ends up being pretty much the same size as the iPhone keyboard. Tap and drag on this bottom handle and we can move this keyboard to anywhere on the display. So we can then thumb type with one hand here. Or we can use the quick path swipe to type method. Use a two-finger spread to expand the keyboard back to its standard size. 